I'm glad to be back. This is a format that uh, I might follow for a little while because the sunlight is awesome, so I get good light uh, for uh, just my toy here that I have. And you know, the cell phone, it is just a toy. Like, I pick it up, and I know that I want to play with it, but I really don't know how to use the toy yet. You know, I, I pick up the camera, I hit record, and I think that it's just going to do all the work for me, and it's just going to make every everything fun. But in reality, I have to put a lot of hard work into it because without hard work, it's not going to get anywhere at all. And that's basically, it's going to be rough around the edges for, for quite a long time here until I get everything down. And, uh, you know, I pick up the toy. I don't even really know what I want to say. I just know that the toy is here now and I can use the toy. I just got to figure out how to get good at the toy so everybody else can enjoy it. And I don't know if I'm looking for gratification from other people or I don't know if I'm just looking for gratification for myself. I know it is a hobby and it's something that can keep me busy and maybe over time I'll become good at the toy and I'll be able to use it and then I'll be able to have you know an archive of footage whatever I want to look back look at it's kind of like an archive I guess of uh, of what was happening at the time but I know that this lights awesome right now so that's nice spring is finally coming around again which is good. We walked walked the streets today a little bit. Like I always do. Because that's what I do. And uh, the streets are looking a little bit better. You know, I'm starting to see pavement on the, all over the place. It's not uh, ice all over now. There's, there's still quite a bit of ice. But... Uh, And with uh, with all this extra sunlight that we're getting, that's why the ice is starting to leave. It doesn't take Albert Einstein to figure that out. But it's still nice, nonetheless. I notice it. And uh, like a lot of things in life, if, if you don't notice it, then, uh, then you can't really enjoy it. And I'm drawing a blank again. But that's okay because I'm not going to be able to come out here and spit just like Eminem would. I'm not going to be able to articulate my thoughts like a prize speaker at a university. A Toastmaster. I'm sure uh, everyone's heard of the Toastmasters Club where they go up there and talk about a certain subject for a long time. You know, I have lots of subjects that I could dive into. But, uh, like, I can talk about music, I can talk about sports, like, mainly hockey. Uh, wrestling is kind of a sport that I'm into as well. But, uh, really, I'm looking more broader. I want to just get simpler with, uh, with these kind of deals. I can be specific, like I said quite easily but being broad is uh, an appealing to maybe the masses is that what I want to do here I don't want to just apply uh, I just don't want to appeal to people who like uh, WWE or people who like uh, the NHL or people who like some of the bands I do like uh, like the Killers that was a band I really liked but uh, I haven't really listened to them for quite a while. I almost overexposed myself to that band. And that's kind of what I'm going through a little bit right now with with Miley Cyrus. I have her Bangers album. And uh, 
it's I haven't overexposed myself yet. I'm still enjoying the whole album. It hasn't gotten played too much, but that's the thing is that you want to make things last. You don't want to just, you know, if I like, uh, for example, I, I like uh, I like spicy sausage, but if I eat spicy sausage every day, then I'm going to get sick of it. And that's why I'd like to get a little bit more broad. I don't have to be as specific with certain things that I like. And that's the great thing about uh, recognizing that uh, it's it's good to like a certain band, but it's good to experiment with other things as well. And that's what creating is really all about.